Hello everyone, welcome to New York. I'm here with Alice. Hi. Good oh to goodness. see you. I'm here visiting. Alice is working in New York for a full year. The last time we saw each other was in May. Yeah. So we've got some catching up to do. We've got a full day of fun ahead. I don't know how I'm gonna split these vlogs up. We've got three full days in New York, then we're in Orlando for a bit. Woo. Today is a very, it's probably our most touristy day, hitting up a lot of the tourist spots and also a lot of the Taylor Swift spots. So I'll point them out as we go to them. But the first stop is Dunkin Donuts because Woo! I want to get I love your love because I'm just like talking Sorry, just, just, <laughs> No, I enjoy I enjoy the interjection. I want to get like a pumpkin-y full vibe coffee and they do it very well in America I'm gonna take you along. Look at how little prints in the windows. A little fire escape. So cute. And what are these? They're princess dresses. Ready for the ball. So I went to an outlet and they had a Disney store. These are really, it's like half price and I was like mum should I get some for Bonnie and she was like obviously. So now I just have them on my rail. America runs on Dunkin. Team Pumpkin. Okay, so I got a pumpkin spice latte with hazelnut. Very intrigued. Is it good? Mm. Very yeah. good, very good, very creamy. And Alice got a hot chocolate. Mm -hmm. Cutie! Right, right. So glamorous. Would you like to unbox our breakfast in the brown bag? It's very suspicious, doesn't it? Oh, so does that person running away? That looks so good. Oh, I got, Ooh. yeah, I got Pattaya, so it's like pink. That is gorgeous. Wow. And this is our little morning view. Update, five out of five. I love I'm it. I'm gonna have pink lips, like natural lipstick. Stranger look my way in your way we are the famous Cornelia Street. Honestly, leave it up to Taylor to pick like such a perfect sounding street name. She's not just living on like Brown. I know street. Brown. Street. Cornelia Street. Do you so think she poetic. considered it? She thinks she was like, I wanna pick a pretty name. Because this could work for a potential song I'd So this is where she used to live. We know she's not there anymore, which is why we're here. You don't wanna go to someone's actual house, that's rude. Weird. But yeah, this is Miss Tay Tay's former residence. Obviously, we're gonna make a TikTok. Let me hear it. Okay, so there's a like one strum. strum and then we're in. Future home goal. I love this concept. Blind date with a book. You don't see the cover. It's got these paper versions. Side note, but book prices in here are absolutely insane. $17 for one book. So apparently when Taylor was outfitting her apartment, she got loads of furniture from this place called ABC Carpet and Home. Thank you. Instantly love the vibe. I love it already. Yeah, this is, this is it. Hypothetically shopping here. I'm a very big Harry Potter fan, so kind of had to come to the Harry Potter New York store and it looks so cool. Gosh, there's wands on the door. Wow. Which character do you think you're most like in Harry Potter? Me? Yeah. Uh, Lavender. Oh my god, I was just thinking that, but I thought it was a bit rude to say. <laughs> the first step to recovery is self acceptance. And who do you think I'm most like? Brody Valentine. Me? Yeah. What do you actually think? Emily, I'll be Hermione. Do you actually think Hermione? I mean, saying that, maybe you're not Hermione. Oh, I'm happy to love them. I have got a combo of the two, which seems like it shouldn't work because Hermione and Luna are so different. But I'm almost yeah. like. I thought like you were younger, you were so obviously Hermione, but I feel like you've grown as a person. I've mellowed into more of a Luna. Yeah, you have. Oh my god, it's my two next to each other. Which one am I gravitating more to? Nice, nice. Dragon Heart Street. This one has got more of a weight to it. I think I am. I can Yeah. These are genuinely cute, and if I wasn't like opposed to giving J.K. Rowling money, it's so pretty though. She used to give it to Johnny. Fiera! <laughs> but yeah, this place is super cool. It's so immersive. Very nice. Even the lift is super cool. <laughs> the most mispronounced moment. He had one job. Playing an Ellie. They have so many unique pieces. Like that's a lamp. My favorite part is always the candy. Oh, bottled butter beer. They have so much cool merch. That is actually quite perfect. How's it, how's it pronounced? Diagonally. Oh my gosh, there is a butter beer bar. Look at the tiny, tiny cake. So cool. In we go. 
That's just us. Yes. yes. Oh my god. Ooh. <laughs> Scary looking. Can we press the button? Oh my gosh, yeah. Where are we going? Uh, up to Madagascar. We are in the flames. Where will we end up? Hopefully not. Diagonally. I know we say this every time, but imagine as 11 year old going into Ollivander's and like, yep, that's your bond. I'd just snap it right up if I was the parent and I was like, no. I'd be like, oh gosh, we're abandoning you now. That was so cool. Is it like an experience in itself? Just wandering around the shop, it's you don't so have to buy cool. anything. I really recommend it. Oh my goodness, yeah, Empire yeah. State. Some pickies may be taken. We are now headed somewhere I am so excited for. I used to be obsessed with a place called By Chloe in the UK. It's all like a moment of silence of By Chloe in the UK. The key more taco bell. Um, so it just disappeared last year from the UK, I say UK, from London. It seemed like the brand just kind of died and then someone in America bought it out and changed the name to Beatnik. And there's loads of them in New York and we are headed there right now, I can see it. Everything is the same, it's the same vibe, it's the same menu. 2019M is alive and well and ready to have our quinoa taco bowl. Look, I can see it right there. This is big. Yeah, this is where we came. The guy next to us had a yes. burger. Right, sorry. So the guy next to us had a and he had a full burger and fries. Great, love that. He cleared everything. And then Tim says his, I think, girlfriend arrived, and they went in all the salads. And it was like such a mood. Like it was like he didn't tell her that he'd already had a burger. <laughs> so good. Everything is the same. It's the same desserts as well. Oh my goodness, we have gone very hard, and I have no regrets. So the classic quinoa taco bell is alive and well in New York. We've got two of those. Here she is. Sweet potato fries. Get your hand on this with the classic chipotle mayo. We've also got. This was my idea and it's probably too much food, but a side of mac and cheese, their beetroot ketchup. I'm a little bit emotional about this, not gonna lie. So the vibe right now is I've just had a day of work at Harrods, coming to Central after work, popped Brownie Melville. Now I'm having dinner and we're gonna go see Waitress after I've eaten this quinoa taco bowl. And with Lee, maybe with Alice, maybe with people we're not friends with anymore. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Right, time to go in with the mac and cheese. Is she as good as I remember? Mm. Oh my gosh. This is a feast. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Gorgeous. We have now reached the High Line as referenced in Taylor Swift's cardigan. Here we go, going up. There is a little map of how it goes. What a view. So the High Line is basically like a walkway through the building with all this greenery around it. Look who's here, she found us! It's like my mind in the middle of the night. At my church! It's a big moment. This is a PSA, there's a new flavour. I don't know if I need it. I get it and I don't love it and I regret it. It's a trick, yeah. I do think it's a risk. That's the good. It's never like Taylor Swift spots because she used to come to the Bay Bakery and she even Instagrammed the cookies here so you know that they're good. We have the magic bag. Oh yeah. my goodness, that is nice. loaded. Look at that, there's so many chocolate chips inside. Chocolate chip with dough. Yeah, basically. Yeah. Big question, do you prefer these or Gideon's from Disney Springs? I know, I said it was big question, I meant it. Wow. You should be able to get one of those next week, so direct comparison. It's really hard to compare because I've only had Gideon's once. Yeah, this one's an old faithful. I have to stick my Lorraine. Lorraine. Okay, interesting. Put it by my girl. Answer may change next week. So <laughs> Subject to change. I think I am team Levain, but like the sea salt on top of the Gideon cookies oh, is chef's kiss. So yeah. I will have, for science, I'll have to get one next week to compare, just for science. I mean, Doing also, it for you. We need to give accurate reporting for you guys, so exactly. we're taking one for the team and getting all the cookies for you. Another Taylor icon, or Gossip Girl, depending on what you prefer. It's the Met. Where Taylor met Joe, where Taylor and Tom Hiddleston went down. So much happened, I want to read the diary entry from that night. <laughs> so, after an hour long queue, we are finally going on the boat Woo! in Dental Park, which is a brand new experience for me. Alice is something of a, uh, a regular. Yeah, that doesn't mean I'm good at, at the actual <laughs> rowing. I'm ready to live out my dream. So, Alice has ended up 
in the rowing position, which was not intentional by me, but honestly, no complaints from me. I'm just vibing, right? Here we are, we have rowed out. Oh my gosh, it's Bay Bridge. It's right over there. Rachel Berry, seeing her tonight. We are going to Funny Girl on Broadway and we bought these tickets like 10 minutes after no, it was announced. I know, and it was actually in the time. It was announced that Leo's in it at one o'clock. Email confirmation at 107. Oh, fantastic seeds. I remember I was getting a sigh with a friend and I was like, I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to be my phone for a second because I have to get these tickets. I bought them. Yeah, but we were, we were communicating oh, okay. and tonight is the night. She's back from COVID. I'm very excited. Here we go. High first Saturday. Don't tell me not to live, just sit and butter. My favorite thing to do is to look at all the different couples and try and invent like a scenario in my head. <gasps> like, is this a first date? Let's do it. Are they married? Are they even together? Like, maybe they're just a, a girl and a boy who are friends. Is this are they headed for a breakup? Is someone cheating? Oh, we don't know if we can deceive cheating just from a boat ride. But I don't know. I like to get the dynamic. Really intense couple. Yeah, right there. Really intense couple. They've been staring in each other's eyes the whole time and like not moving. It's kind of uncomfortable from my perspective. There she is, hey. Miss Leah Michelle. So where are we? We're famous something. World's best cup of coffee. <laughs> oh, um, Marius. He looks fun. Alice has gone for. Classic cheese, and mine is broccoli, tomato, and spinach. I think it's also hotter than the sun in here. You, you need, need it. it. You need it. I need it. Absolutely. This is like the exact one. Isn't yeah. It? So we came in this little shop to try and get like tacky souvenir shirts, thinking to get the I Heart NY ones, but I think Alice just needs this one. I don't know. Maybe I'll get the same one. I'll pretend I'm wearing some shirt. That one is gross, but I love it. Absolutely it is time! So we have a mug, a mug with some magnet, poster, a good selection. But I'm happy with my $15 t-shirt. We are inside the theatre, our seats are insane. We so have good. I'll play Bill. I'm so excited. This is still the Michelle. I put the, the Glee tour in. People keep on going on about and I don't want to see who she is. Me and Michelle. Yeah. Me and Michelle. Thank you. Thrilled. Thrilled. We are turning to Broadway. Lee is an award winning actress, singer, and a best selling author. author. Best selling author. <laughs> <laughs> she really threw that in there for the Goat Heart Read series. <laughs> We're at the interval. We just had Don't Run in My Parade. Wow. I wish she sat there like. <laughs> We've we stood up like four times oh, yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah, 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 that's right. There's one guy on like Bro B. Oh he my god, the every, every, every number. He's, he's really related it. to the cast. Yeah. Like, yeah. Hearing Leah Michelle, she just sounds like the recording. Just, her voice is just perfect. Like, like pitch perfect. There's not an error in there. Like she's just amazing. She's so funny as well. So. People were like, is she going to be able to act it? Like she can sing it because oh my god. Yes. yes. She's made for this part.